Today was introduction to nerves, 102 this afternoon, introduction to speed, who has it and who doesn't. This is CBS. Texans are moving to Texas Commerce. The auto parts. Take that turn. Don't follow the outside. So make sure you stay the inside. It's a small island in this turn right here. Oh, it's good. We need to I mean, right, right here. Okay. The Americans check the course before the start of the critical team time trial. This is a race where all nine men ride together and share a common time at the finish. Weakness cannot be hidden. The faster riders will lose time if the slower ones cannot keep up. There is a five Andy Hampson knows his fate is in the hands yeah, of his teammates. Their time is his time. A poor performance could ruin his chance of winning the yellow jersey later. Last year at this time, the 7-Eleven team was basking in the glow of the yellow jersey. Alex Stita had shocked the cycling world by winning the second stage of the tour one year ago today. That morning race had been the most important moment in cycling history for the Americans, and that afternoon, the riders were relaxed and happy as they rolled out of the Paris suburbs for their team time trial. Happy, that is, until disaster struck. Everything that could go wrong, did go wrong. team came unglued, splintered into separate parts, each rider trying to survive the near total collapse. The defense of the yellow jersey was all but over. Not like the way it was with the well-oiled European racing machine sprinting in single file, each rider taking his turn at the front to break the wind, the group riding faster together than any single rider could alone. from his all-out effort to get the yellow jersey only hours before became an albatross around the neck of his team as they tried to pull him home. They suffered the embarrassment of being passed by a team starting five minutes behind. So as the first group of six riders crossed the finish line, the American team realized that last year's Tour de France was really over for them on the second day of racing. They had come within seconds of losing their last three riders, including Steeda trio just making the cutoff, which eliminates any rider finishing too far behind the leader. But things would change for these dejected athletes, and like the phoenix from the ashes, the American team has risen again. It's going to be an American team out there that isn't just going to be this picture of struggle and and uh you know hanging on to survive you know we got to be up there we got to be dealing the cards this year we got to be doing stuff in the race and i you know maybe that sounds boastful but we have to do it i mean we don't have a guy like andy hansen on this team to not do that and we're not going to leave him high and dry there's too much talent too much motivation and, and too much to lose like bob the one thing you can't do is stand up on the front because you accelerate without really realizing it when you went over that last hill you just about determined not to relive last year's nightmare the american team stayed in california during the european racing season to work on the coordination and teamwork needed to battle their foreign adversaries working together at home was a risk because it kept them six thousand miles away from the people they would face in the tour de france go as smooth as we were going but just a little bit faster Right. Total relax. Total so we'll relax. do one more big lap and then come back here and stop again and then we'll see about doing another, oh, maybe a lap or two on the oh. five mile circuit. Right. Fueled by a one and a quarter million dollar budget, almost double that of last year propelled by a newly acquired $200,000 a year star in Andy Hampston, 7-Eleven had stepped into the big time of professional cycling. The 
skills of the team time trial practiced on the back roads and rolling hills of Southern California might make the difference in Andy Hampson getting the yellow jersey or not having a chance. will soon be tested here in Berlin on the second day of the Tour de France.